Hello, I'm Senki, an application engineer at Keysight Technologies. In this video, I'm going to demonstrate the Pathwave Bentry lab management and control solutions. The software is a complete centralized, remote access and integrated approach for bench management, lab configuration, lab administration, asset tracking and firmware updates. It provides streamlined lab management with centralized control for educators to seamlessly connect and monitor all instruments within the teaching lab. With the lab configuration feature, educators can streamline and simplify lab management works, saving the lab administrator and educators time and freeing them to focus on teaching. It's easy to set up and configure a wide range of instruments based on actual lab and bench layout. The lab can be configured either manually or by importing from a CSV file. It allows up to 100 benches with a maximum of 6 instruments configured in a single bench and even non-Kisa instruments are supported. It allows you to map the rows, columns and customize the lab layout according to your actual lab physical bench position. To further streamline the flexibility of multiple labs, different lab layouts can be configured, saved and used interchangeably. The lab administration feature provides the lecture, lab manager, a quick overview of the current instrument connection status and easily identifies which instrument on which bench is not correctly connected from a single viewpoint. The connection status of all the instruments will be displayed according to the color code, where green shows the instrument connected and active, red indicates the instrument is disconnected or having connection error, and grey out indicates the instruments are not configured. With this software, you can easily reset all the instruments at once, either to a pre-configured state or to its default settings. As a lecturer or lab admin, you will want to have an option to quickly configure the instruments setting in bulk or reset all the instruments before each lab session or after a student uses the instruments. In this section, I will demonstrate the asset tracking feature that provides an intuitive management tool for educators to easily keep track of a long list of assets in the lab including instruments, equipment and accessories. The asset tracking is designed to manage instrument loaning, instrument calibration schedule tracking with email reminder and asset reports viewing as well. Items may be added to the asset tracking list manually, import from lab layout or from a CSV file. To add a new asset manually, go to the asset tracking tab and click the Add New Asset icon. Input all the asset informations. You may quickly import all the instruments for the lab layout previously configured into the asset tracking list as well. Click Import to add all the configured instruments from the selected lab layout. Pathwave Benchview Lab Manager includes management tools to keep track of instruments calibration. Calibration information can be added to each asset by selecting the desired asset and click the Details button. A notification message will appear when the date is approaching on the actual date. The set tracking checking out feature is useful for tracking the physical locations of the instruments where it is often sent out for loan or calibrations. To check out an item, select the desired item for checking out. Fill in the checkout information, click check out to check out the item. The item will now be stated as check out under the status column. The Pathwave Benchware Lab Manager provides automatic reminder notifications for instrument calibrations due date and asset checkout and date. The reminder notification settings are customizable according to the user preference. Click on the set alert and you may customize how often and at what time the system performs reminder scan on the lab assets for calibration notifications or asset checkout reminder. 
You may also choose to send an email notifications to the recipients. Pathway Bench View Lab Manager include a mass firmware update applications to update most of the KISA instruments to the latest firmware available. Go to the firmware update tab. It will show a list of lab layouts. And select the lab layout for the instruments that you wish to perform a firmware update. Once the layout is selected, the application will scan all the connection status of the instruments. The scanning process will take some time. Once the scan is completed, all the instruments in the lab layout selected will show the firmware version of each instrument. Then, select the instruments that you wish to update and proceed with the run update. The firmware update will begin and wait for the update process to complete. Thanks for watching.